GV and gang, welcome back, welcome back. Bit of a different one today, sorry. I'm really, really tired. I just literally woke up two seconds ago, but heading to the gym. Gotta go to the gym for about half an hour or so. Because I feel like shit. I feel so unfit. When I wake up in the mornings, I just feel gross. So I'm gonna head to the gym for about an hour. So after that, we're going to the Back to the Beach Festival. So a bit of nostalgia for me. Obviously, I used to listen to Screamo maybe like two or three years ago, I mean, eight or nine years ago, not two or three years ago, it's, it's definitely rap, but yeah, you still listen to it about eight or nine years ago, so we're going there, I don't know what it's going to be like, um, I think it's like story of the year, fuck, who else is going, um, The Used is the main event, The Used will be mad, but yeah, I don't really listen to the music anymore, I still don't mind, I don't, I don't mind that shit, like Juice World and stuff like that is sort of like a rap rendition of Scream on my opinion, so it should be good to see. But first, let's go work out. Gonna be quiet. There's a squirrel. <laughs> Hi, little guy. Hi. <laughs> we don't have squirrels in Australia, so it's pretty cool. <laughs> He's just chilling. Well, I attempted to go to the gym, but it's just too awkward. There's too many people in there. Really, really small place. So I'm not going to bother, maybe I did like 20 minutes, not much at all. So I'm going to go back, get changed, and then we'll be on our way to, we're probably going to go to Laguna Beach and all that stuff beforehand, so we'll see how we go. So as I'm getting ready, I'm just sort of making a little beat, you know, a little bit of this, a little bit of that, but I don't know, we're going to listen to Screamo and all that type of shit, but this is not Screamo, man. This is rap. This is rap. So I just made that. Just a small, I don't know, just a small little something. But I think it's like quarter past ten at the moment. We're getting ready to go out to the Back to the Beach Festival. Obviously, we want to do a few things beforehand. So we're going to go to Laguna Beach. Hopefully, it's good there. You can probably see the weather. Oh, God, okay. Yeah, the weather isn't the best. It's overcast. I think I think it's supposed to get like a maximum of like, I don't know, 18 degrees, which isn't which isn't good, which isn't good. And the festival that we're going to also doesn't take cameras or any so it says selfie sticks are not allowed. So I don't know how I'm going to go with this big tripod looking piece of shit, but we'll see how we go and we'll be on our way soon. There's not one bit of blue in the sky right now. <laughs> this is gonna be, yeah, it's gonna be a struggle. I think it's on the beach as well. We've got, we packed the beach towels and stuff like that, but. Okay. I have a feeling I'm really gonna regret wearing a, a tank top. Tank top, but apparently it's called a muscle tee, I don't know. But it's freezing. Let's just hope that my energy makes me warm because there ain't shit else making me warm right now so we're just driving on this road this highway and literally i'm pretty sure like every two miles is just like a large amount of weed smell i don't know where it's coming from it must be like weed factories or something i wouldn't mind visiting there because i i'm pretty sure all the people that be working there would be pretty pretty nice um going up to the profession but i think this is probably going to be one of the last times we drive on this highway yeah no I'm pretty sure it is Oh, okay, so it's not the last time, Santana. but... Santana! South! South, 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 <laughs> south, south, this way. Oh. You're seeing the right way. Okay. The very right one, yeah. Okay. But yeah, so, I don't know if there's a... There's a weed leaf. That's a weed leaf just there. <laughs> Welcome to the new normal. It's an abandoned building that looks like, yeah, no. We're in weed central, I think, now. <laughs> Bit of a fucking shitty update. We have to go back. We have to go back home. Obviously, we forgot our tickets. Um, the most important thing that we had to bring. And we've got that, so... Today's already going great. I mean, shitty weather. Forgetting our tickets. What else can go wrong? I'm not too sure, but... I'm sure there's a lot more that will happen. And go wrong as time goes on. This camera probably won't get into fucking this place. And yeah, it's been a good day so far. Let's uh, let's keep it going, I guess. Are you recording? 
Yeah. What is that thing in the sky? There's like something blue in the sky. It's like a cloud, but not a cloud. There's some alien shit happening out here. Can you, are you even looking at it? I am, but the tree's covering it. Oh. If I move up like this, can you see it? No. That's crazy. What the hell was that? It was like Aurora Borealis, but not on steroids. Just quickly running to grab the tickets. I don't want to be too long, so I'm sort of sprinting. I gotta fix this. Whatever this is, it's fringe that looks like it's fucking two parts. But I'm running to grab it now so we can get going. It's, it's lucky it was only 45 minutes back, but still. 45 minutes wasted, just trying to grab the shit. Oh my God. Piece of shit. Piece of shit. God. <sighs> Things have happened to me. Ah, that's gotta be it. Okay. Where are these tickets? Log rendering ticket here. Is this the other one? Ticket there. And now I'm gonna straighten the fringe and fix this shit. So I've got the tickets, but I'm pretty sure I just fucked up my hair so badly. I need a fucking brush or something because I just I messed it up royally, but I'm running down to the car now so then we can be on our way finally again. Drive through the same shit and hopefully get there. By around one o'clock, I think we'll get there, so not too bad. This fucking guy has a fan on the back of his four right. A fan. For what? For what reason? It's not a boat. You don't own a boat. Why do you have that? Why do you have a propeller or two? <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to focus on this fan. It's the weirdest thing I've ever seen in my life. We're making our way through Huntington Beach. So, I've never actually been to a beach festival before. I can see a, a couple of people going there. Is it here? Do we have to turn or no? It's on the left, apparently. Okay. That's weird. Right. I'm just gonna stop here. Yep. So, we're on our way. I think this one is to stop for us. Yep. Oh my god, I don't know where I'm going. I'm lost. But anyway, I've never been to a beach festival before, so it should be interesting. I wish it was a rap festival, that would have been awesome, but unfortunately it's not. It is what it is, I think. It's down, it's down there. It's down there? Okay. So we're trying to find a park now. Really nice area though. Do you reckon here? No. Okay. Oh my god, so many people. To turn left and then left again. Alright, here we go. So yeah, we're trying to find a park. I just wanted to sort of give you guys an update because obviously I'm, I haven't been talking for like an hour and a bit, but it didn't take that long to get here. Like we went home and back and it still was quicker than everywhere else we've been so far. So, And I can see a lot of people have like long sleeve t-shirts on and that type of shit. So, oh, this guy's gonna let me through, sweet. And there's no lights here, this is weird. Like you stop every, every intersection and then you let the other person go. You just have to trust that they stop. I like that, I like that a lot. And this is in the walkway, but okay. But yeah, we'll find a park and then we'll be going to the beach festival, but <laughs> he, did he wave to you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? I guess turn left and then we'll try to... Here? Oh, yeah, just, just hide in there. Okay. So I guess this is a entrance. Okay, cool. So we're finally parking. We'll see how we go with um, the festival. I don't know if I'm going to get in, to be honest, with this camera. But we'll, we'll see what happens. The way I tricked the security guards before was taking off the lens and then, like, putting the, the cover on so it looked like a, just a normal camera without a lens and then I had the lens in the bag. They would have seen the lens in the bag but they probably just didn't bat an eyelid so I don't know how we're going to go with these guys. I have a feeling it's going to be a bit different. I reckon these guys are going to be like nah you ain't getting in with this shit because this tripod looks like a serious weapon. I probably could kill three people with it. There's a, it's three legs, one for each person but I'll give it a go. If I don't then I'll just try and bring the GoPro. I mean if my filming looks a bit different, obviously it's going to look a lot different on the GoPro, so 
I'll try and get as much as I can. If I can't get anything, then I'll probably have to, like, there won't be much of this vlog, to be honest. It will be just me going there, maybe getting some film on my phone, if worst case scenario. I'll try and vlog on my phone, but it'll look shit anyway. So we'll see what we can do with the best tools that we have, but I hope I can get in with this. Honestly, I really do. And this festival went for like two days, so I miss out on Blink-182, Goldfinger, The Real Big Fish, uh, Streetlight Manifesto, The Aquabats, I think as well, um, Save Ferris. The only real people I wanted to see anyway was like Blink-182, The Used, um, who else? Less Than Jake, maybe, Story of the Year, and who was the other person? There was one more, I don't remember exactly what they were called, but that's all I really came here for. So hopefully, hopefully it's alright. I mean, I think there's like, what, six or seven acts or something like that, so still good nonetheless. Just in case I don't get any footage, there's a couple of land, uh, a couple of Ferraris here. I think it's a California and an F430, so everyone's enjoying this festival. So we messed up, parked in the wrong area, so we have to go back to the car drive a little bit further up and then we have to walk to the festival, it's already like 1.50. Story of the year started at 2.30 I think, so we have to we have to hurry a bit. Hopefully we get there in time for the start of this, I don't know how big this place is going to be, how many people are there, etc. I don't think there's that, like, obviously the comparison between Coachella and Back to the Beach is going to be second to none, but like, it's still going to be pretty packed I think at this time and Story of the Year is probably one of the biggest uh, that's going to be there for today, so. Once we get to the car park and pay for the parking that I didn't really use, we'll head off and go down the road and pay for more parking. Okay, so, festival, much more stricter than Coachella, I don't even un understand why, but apparently you can only have clear bags, you can't even have normal bags, you can't take any tripods, anything like that in, you can't take purses in, so am I supposed to go naked or something? I don't know at this point, I I'm pretty sure I have to strip down to barely nothing. I only have undies for this place. I mean, can't take my phone, but well, I can, but it just feels like I can't take anything here. So I won't be able to record maybe on my phone a little bit, but I won't be able to vlog. It like it would just look stupid in my opinion. So I won't I won't vlog too much, but I'll I'll try and capture some content. If there's funny shit in there, I'll I'll definitely get it for you guys. But it is what it is. So I, I will see you after the festival. I think it ends pretty late I think it ends at like 9 so it's probably gonna go from complete and utter cloudy weather sunny weather to complete darkness so I'll see you then sorry about the bugs but nice little wrapped Corvette co 6 and the focus is terrible but pretty nice co 6 and then it just gets in the way of it but it's got one of those um those really big carbon splitters on the front as well Really nice, sounds really good. I heard it on the road before, but. So we have been driving around literally for like an hour, trying to find parking. Paid for parking, had to go out of the parking lot, cause that owl, <laughs> owl, had to get out of the parking spot. Because that was full, and now we went into another car spot, and that parking lot was full, or closed, or whatever. And now we're at the third one, and we've been waiting for like 10 minutes to get into this one, so. Story of the year on right now, and I'm gonna miss it. I'm gonna be pretty mad, but it's okay. It is like, what are you supposed to do? Like, you can't, you can't predict what's happening right now. But yeah, there's a lot of pushing, a lot of shoving in this parking lot. I'm trying to get my way in and get out of this car before I miss too much of the story of the year because he's one. Like, they're one of the two bands that I wanted to see. So we'll see how we go. I don't know how it is, but I might vlog if there's something funny. But I don't think I will be vlogging for the next probably like five hours. So. Enjoy the lack of content. I'm sorry. Free rock star. Free rock star. So potentially I could be the only one with a GoPro in here. I have to like sneak around security guards and whatnot trying to get it in here but we got it in here had to like go out of the line and back into the line but yeah I don't know what it's gonna look like having this and like my proper camera I'm not too sure what it looks like so if it doesn't look good I won't put it in there but 
for now. We're just gonna wait for the story so far. Yeah. Yeah, we'll wait story. for the story for so far, and then we'll go from there. I think we have like two hours or so to chill out, drink some free rock star, and look at all the look at all the sites to talk about. So, see so how we go. Oh, there's the set times, babe. So. Six twenty. Six twenty. We have to be here. That's not too bad. We're just walking around now. I think we've got we got three hours. We got a lot of time. It's a lot of time to kill. <laughs> it's a pretty big crowd. Not gonna lie. In comparison to Coachella, though, it's like it's nothing. It's literally like a heaven sent, to be honest. But obviously, not as good as people here. Like Ariana Grande and all that type of shit was there. So I don't know. We'll check out the food. I don't think there's a lot more to see here besides merch and food. But yeah, we'll have a look around. I don't know, man. I'm always hungry. I'm always, I'm always hungry. This place is pretty big. I'm not gonna lie. This place is pretty, pretty massive. But we're trying to find something to do. We're trying to not buy merchandise because there's a lot here. I don't really, I don't know. As I said before, I'm not a big fan of merchandise. Like it's cool to have stuff like that, but I'd rather something plain or something designer. Nothing, nothing branded by a band. Like it doesn't really interest me. Back to the beach it's a pretty cool sign I think on this side it's like back to the beach and then I'll show you it once I've got to the end but it's like here and then as you walk back it's the blink 102 that's the blink 102 sign pretty mad pretty mad I don't get to see blink 102 obviously rest in peace to there I think it's the lead singer I don't remember guitarist I'm not too sure but awesome awesome sign Pretty nice festival as well. Haven't really watched anyone yet, but gonna get there, gonna get there. Australian, Australian accent. Okay. We're banging this shrock. <laughs> Don't touch me. <laughs> Damn it, it's so English. It's so English. It's so English. <laughs> you said crikey? It's crikey. Get off me. Please stop moving. <laughs> I'm moving whatever I want. Uh, that was good. That was good. Wait, At least you know. Crikey is Australian, but, but no, no one says it. That's what, it what's it's, his name? Steve Irwin. Steve Irwin. You guys never told us your names. What are your names? Tiffany. Nicole. Oh. And Paul. And Gavin. Gavin? Is that all? Australian? Yeah. I'm going to quickly take the seat before it goes. <laughs> Look at this for a fruit bowl. She said that she thinks it's like really dry and hard to get down. Like that's why you need a little water. Yourself, Has anyone here tonight seen this band for the first time? Yeah. Yeah. Damn. What's yeah. up, man? Good to meet you. Uh, hope it's not the last. I see some familiar faces out here, too. Hell yeah. Once again, man, thank you for growing up with this band. Thank you for being there. Thanks for listening. We got one more. What the story so far?
name's John Reese, my company's SG. I put this on with Travis Barker and John Feldman. This is the last band of the festival. And folks, we saved the best for last. I work in a lot of genres of music and do a lot of cool stuff. This is my favorite band on the entire planet Earth, The Used. that at a used concert, you're obligated to be your childlike selves once again, all right? Here's another old song for all the hardcore fans. Here we go. Present mirth hath present laughter. What's to come is still unsure. In delay there lies no plenty. Then come kiss me, sweet and twenty. Youths of stuff will not endure. How many of you here? would consider yourself to be a bigger used fan than the person next to you. I wanna take a, I wanna take a special moment right now to dedicate this next song to all the beautiful children in our lives. All of us have children. And to, and to the children we all used to be at one point. Do you remember? Do you remember before you had your fucking phone shoved in front of your face? Do you remember?
back to the car. So really, really good festival. Um, really nostalgic. The used and all that type of stuff were there. Used was really good. Made you feel like you went back in time, to be fair, to 2010 when I had emo hair, emo fringes, and everyone had emo fringes. But it was really good. It was really good to um, see all, them all out and about. So great festival. I think we've done so much so far. I think we've done a lot in... I don't know, not even two weeks yet, and we've still got Disneyland, Universal Studios, all that type of stuff, so, yeah, we've got a long way to go, I think, tomorrow is Disneyland, so stay tuned for that, and I've got a lot of other content, obviously, behind me as well, so Coachella and all that type of stuff is there as well, so go check that out, subscribe, like all this shit, comment what you thought, what do you think about the use, what do you think about all that stuff, and I will see you next video. So before I go, I just want to show you how much shit is in my fucking shoes. Uh, not that one, it's this one. <laughs> Lovely. Vivian, play that back, boy.